This is a 2007 iMac. It's definitely outdated, but it could be used for web browsing and basic tasks. However, it doesn't have official support for latest macOS versions, like Catalina, and it is definitely held back by that. There is an unofficial patcher, which allows installing macOS on unsupported Macs, but this Mac also requires a CPU upgrade to support Catalina. I'm also upgrading RAM and installing an SSD. This Mac has an official RAM capacity of max 4 GB, but in fact it can take 6. The screen can be lifted with a flathead screwdriver, but to prevent leaving marks in the aluminium, suction cups are also an option. When lifting the screen, be very careful not to touch the power supply. Power supply is the blue board in the upper left corner. Previous owner of this Mac has already installed an SSD, but I'm going to change it for a smaller capacity one, because this will only be used for web browsing. There is four different types of screws, so it's important to remember which goes where. Since I've taken the motherboard out, I will apply a new thermal paste to the GPU. If the thermal pads on the memory chips get damaged while taking off the heatsink, they can also be replaced.
Before reassembling you can take some dust out of the fans and the power supply. To install Catalina, you will need a computer running macOS, 16GB or greater capacity USB drive and Catalina patcher by DosDude1. I will put a link in the description. This patcher is made by DosDude1 and running Catalina on this Mac is possible because of his work. He has a more detailed tutorial video. I will put a link in the description. Insert the USB drive, power on the Mac and hold the ALT or OPTION key to boot from the USB. When it boots you need to format the SSD with APSF and then you can install. When booting for the first time, it will ask you to install some patches. Because Catalina for this Mac is not officially supported, installing system updates normally might break the system and require a reinstall. I consider the 2007 iMac with an official Catalina to have perfectly adequate performance for web browsing. In fact I didn't expect an old dual core to be this fluid. 
with two Safari windows and uh, 10 tabs open. The scrolling gets a little choppy with heavier websites sometimes, but I would say that it's even enjoyable to use. Almost everything would seem to work. Wi-Fi, Ethernet, Bluetooth, optical drive and camera work flawlessly. There's very minor graphical glitches sometimes in transparent Mac OS menu items. Speakers work and sound quality is great. Microphone seems to detect some sound but Siri doesn't seem to work with it. Siri works with a Bluetooth headset though. Most benchmarks complain about missing Metal API support and refuse to run. I tried installing some games just for fun. Most of them have serious difficulties even in the main menu. Some don't launch at all like Asphalt 9, which is an iOS app running on macOS via Catalyst compatibility layer. Some more basic Catalyst apps like Twitter however work okay.